Hey baddies, I'm the Bad Enabler and I'm here with the empties for the last like few weeks. I have to be honest with you, I've thrown out a bunch of empties that I just thought to myself, you've seen this before, like don't save it for the video, you'll be fine, no one needs to see that again. And I thought I just pulled out the empties as I thought, oh my lanta, it's a lot. So, um, first things first, the friend mail that I received over the last couple of weeks was unexpected and awesome and it made my day when I had a bad day it just like it was everything so um this was in friend mail not the candle but the candle holder and it is gorgeous it's a bath and body works candle holder from I don't know when this came out but it looks like all of my Yankee candle stuff and it was a really really sweet gesture and thought so thank you so much for this I adore it I love it I think it's beautiful it's just it's gorgeousness so I have the Garden Arugula and Verbena candle from Bath and Body Works inside of it, just because it looks nice. Anyway, love it, love it, love it. Made my day and uh, made my week. And then cookies, you've got no idea that when I, after a very long day of, after a very long day, to get a box and then say, I don't know what's in this box. And then I shook it, shook the box and it was an odd sound. I thought, what is in here? And then I opened it up and I'm like, who sent me cookies? Thank you so much. That was the sweetest thing. And I love these cookies. I especially, you can guess which one is my favorite. It's the pretzel with the sugar on it. It's like, there's something about that specific cookie that I always brr, brr, eat the whole thing. So thank you, 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 thank uh, you. I just can't even. It was very random, very crazy acts of kindness that completely, Everyone has having tough days, but like this just, anyway, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you for the friend mail. Um, let's go to the empties. Ah, it's a lot. Sorry, not sorry. This is a lot of Josie. I told you I'm like going into my Josie mode. So this is the face butter. It's 1.7 ounces. I'll explain what the face butter is. It's in the scent fresh watermelon. Light scent. She only uses natural fragrances in her scents. So she doesn't have like a bunch of chemicals and stuff to make the scent. It's like the essence of a watermelon. Lovely, light, and it dissipates within seconds of it being on your skin. Also finished up Beekman 1802. Body cream and the scent Arcadia. It was eight ounces. This scent is divine. It's like an earthy and exotic scent at the same time. It's not a grassy smell, but it's like almost as if, almost as if you got off of the lawnmower after you accidentally plowed through a field of daffodils and things like that. Like you didn't mow the lawn, you mowed the flowers and you just smell kind of like a lawnmower man but also kind of like a bunch of flowers and it's called arcadia arcadia sponsored by jamie lee curtis no i'm kidding that's activia and that is for movie so um i also finished up <laughs> josie marin another josie marin this is uh, whipped argan oil it's four ounces i don't even have to look at it and it's in the scent milk and honey uh old dated reference but do you remember wayne's world with um honey uh played by kim basinger She's so funny. What a great actress. Anyway, it doesn't, uh, it doesn't smell like milk or honey. It smells as if, it smells almost as if you were whacked in the face of the beehive and then like went to a candy store. It was like, oh my God, I'm traumatized. I got hit in the face by a beehive. Let me go candy shopping. It smells kind of like that, like very sweet, but subdued at the same time, like a little comatose. Anyway, so I love this to pieces. I was very sad to see this go, like very sad to see this go. I did not want to finish this, but I had the littlest bit left. And I finally said, you know what? You need to just finish it like an adult. Um, I don't know which scent that was, so I need to go get it. And we're back. Oh. Ugh. Okay. This was fresh watermelon. It matches the face butter. This is the eight ounce argan oil. Oh my word, I'm gonna ruin my pants. I'm wearing new pants. Do you wanna see what they are? They got pumpkins on them. Ugh. All right. So um, they're pajama pants. Class act. The fresh watermelon is also, it's so, 
yummy. Um, it makes the thing about the argan oil body butter, and I am not a Josie spokesperson, person, although I wish I were. Um, is that if you use it for a few days in a row, you have this argan shine to you when you're not wearing it. It's amazing. Did I show you the inside of it? Empty. So finish this one up. Also finished up because you know you're gonna get tired of seeing all the Josies. Another Josie, thirteen point five ounce, mega size. This was in the scent. Unscented. This is in the scent unscented. It smells like nothing. There's nothing inside. It's just, I I just, every time I went to bed lately for the last like month or so, I've been dousing myself with it and just waking up feeling like a quadrillion dollars. If that's a real number, look it up. Also finished, did I finish this? No, why is this? I think I thought about chucking it. Because you know why? Because it's shea butter and I love shea butter from the body shop and I love the scent of it, don't get me wrong, but I've been using so much of the Josie that there was so little left of this I felt reluctance to use it. And I was like, I'm just gonna use it to use it. It's very utilitarian. So it might be hitting, uh, I'll use it. I'll use it on my feet or something. Not that there's anything wrong with my feet, but let's put it over there. Also finished up another fresh watermelon. So it's two fresh watermelons. Love, anyway. So finished up two fresh watermelon, one giant unscented, and a little milk and honey. Also carrot wash from Body Shop. I thoroughly enjoy this. I feel like it has a brightening effect on your skin. It's an energizing face cleanser. I believe it works. I have another one of these in the shower and I might have one more as a backup in my little storage bin thingy. 3.3 um, ounces, it does a great job. I Between this and the vitamin E, I'd probably pick the vitamin E. The vitamin E is my savior. The vitamin E is my saving grace. Anytime I have a skin issue, I go back to the vitamin E. And I'm talking 20 something years of using the vitamin E all the time, like sporadically. That's a contradiction, that's an oxymoron. But I use it all the time when I need to. How about that? I finished Drops of Youth, the eye concentrate. Um, it's basically the bouncy eye mask. So it says youth bouncy eye mask. Um, it's very thick, it's very gelatinous. Put it on at night and just let it do its work with the bouncy mask. Um, it has a tendency to have like this weird sensation when it's on you, not a feeling, but more of a result of a scent that's in the product. It might be a natural scent, but sometimes it irritates my eyes just a little bit, like it makes them tear, but I still use it because I think it's good. I also finished up Milk from Josie Marin. This is the intensive hydrating treatment. It's your toner. It's the thing that you put on before you put on your moisturizer. Love it to pieces. Um, I, ooh, look, see it's broken now. That's what happens. I, when it was done, I shook, shook, I shook, 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 got the last drops out. I love that. Um, finish up a Bath & Body Works product. Sea Mineral Body Wash Cleanse. This is the Sea Tox, Mermaid approved. It smells like, like the ocean kind of sort of, or like, like salt water. It, it has a great smell. I loved it. I was also sad to see this go. I do have to be honest with you. A nice lather. Hmm. I'm thinking already about my favorites of this last few weeks. This is a scent that I went through in record time. I don't know how much is... I knew it. Evil people. Watch what they did. This is a scent called Aphrodite's Rose or Aphrodite's Rose. And it's an eau de toilette from Coors. K-O-R-R-E-S. I was wondering how I finished this so quickly. Let's take a closer look. Look how much glass is around the edges. You see this? Glass, 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 glass. That little vial inside, I never noticed how small it is. I thought it was 3.3 .3 ounces, like most of these sizes are. It's 1.69 ounces. That's how they get you. They made it look like a giant jar, and instead it's like, you could use it to thwart a burglar if someone comes in your house at night. It's a very weighty piece. However, it's 1.69 ounces of product. That's not a lot. So, that's done. It, it seriously smelled like rose essence, rose extract. It was just very much rose. Um, I, this might be only the second bottle I've ever finished of this. This is the Argan Milk Intensive Hydrating Body Renewal Serum. That's a mouthful. It's basically the milk essence for your face, but this one's for your body. You put it on after you cleanse as basically your body toner and it sinks down into your pores and then you put on the body butter. If you haven't tried it, uh, it's argan oil plus lactic acid, so it actually rejuvenates the skin, refreshes the skin, promotes new cell growth, I believe. Uh, this is the 6.7 ounce bottle. I would not recommend spending $44 on this. I would recommend getting it in one of the sets where you get a bunch of different things for about that price, but you get three full-size products or two full-size products. Don't buy, in my humble opinion, don't buy the carrot wash on its own. Don't buy anything that I've shown you on its own, basically. Buy it as part of a set. Buy it as a buy two, get one free. 
Use your coupons, use Rakuten. The link is in the description box down below. Copy, paste it, use it. You will get money for signing back. It might be like, I don't know. It might be like 10 bucks, it might be 20 bucks, it might be 25 bucks, but you get something for signing up. So I have two things left. And one thing is gigantic and the other thing is not. Hello to the close up. So Mars Pond Dreams. This is 32 ounces of body wash that I used. It's from Philosophy. It's shampoo, shower gel, and bubble bath. I've I only use it as a shower gel, but it smells so good. It smells like marzipan and dreams. It's a sweet, sugary, confectionery scent. Almost, if you like macarons, those sandwich, those gluten-free sandwich things with the goo in the middle, it smells like a macaron. It smells like the best, like, bag of macarons. It doesn't smell like one specific, it doesn't smell like raspberry or something like that. It smells like a bag of macarons, like, and you stuck your face in it. I love this, very sad to see it go. Very sad to see it go. This is one of the things that I'm the most sad about seeing going because I feel like I'll never find this again. I feel like with philosophy, sometimes they have them in certain sizes and then it's poof, it's gone. And I don't think I'll ever see this again. So I'm really, really sad to see this go. So this is gonna stay in my lap as something that um, is one of the favorites of the month or the, the amount of time. And then finally, the last thing that I'm showing you that I have up as an empty is Chinese ginseng and rice. It is the facial, um, mask from the body shop. It's retails at $28, but again, buy it as a set. You'll see there's no label on it because I was going to put this, this is my empties. And while I was like cleaning it out, like washing it and blah, blah, blah. I realized this is a really nice jar and I'm not someone who saves old jars because I feel like there's a thin line between saving things to use them and saving things to save them. And, but it's a nice jar. Like you could use it for paper clips. You could use it for buttons you could use it for what do you put in jars um if you're a crafter you've got those little googly eyes that you, you know like they're the white things little black people and it's like blah, blah, blah. if you have a, a bunch of googly eyes you can put the googly eyes in this jar and it'd be cool it would look a little real because it looks like a medicine jar anyway um so creepy but halloween's coming so why not I think that you could totally, you just peel the labels off because there's one label on the front that said Chinese ginseng and rice and the label on the back that had the ingredients or whatever and the one on the bottom, peel them all off and it's fine. The only thing that says the body shop is the top and boss part and you know what, that's not bad. So my favorite things of the month were, uh, oh, the milk and honey. I like the milk and honey from Josie Marin and I really like this, which I'll probably never see again. So hashtag sad face. Um, what would I not buy again? I ask these questions to myself all the time. Even though I know, I know that I have another Aphrodite's Rose, I probably wouldn't buy it having noticed now that it's 1.69 ounces because that's really small. Um, so I probably wouldn't buy that again. I would buy the Seatox again from the Bath and Body Works. All the Josie stuff I would buy again. I, I always have uh, extras of the Body Shop stuff. So I feel like, yeah. The one thing that I might not buy again um, would be, the, I would buy Arcadia again. Um, the only thing that I might not buy again would be the Shea from the Body Shop just because I feel like the Josie is a more natural ingredient at this point, unless the Body Shop reformulates their old shea butter. Um, and I just want to say thank you again for the friend mail. Thank you again and again and again and again and again. I love, 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 love. I love, 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 love. It was so thoughtful, so kind, so beautiful, so wondrous. So thank you for doing that. Um, what else can I say? Uh, be careful, be safe, be fun, be happy. If you're shopping online, I know that Amazon Day is coming up in a couple of days. Amazon Prime Day. Amazon sometimes is on Rakuten. So if you didn't sign up for Ebates, or if you didn't sign up for Rakuten, use the link in the description box down below because this way you save money and you get discounts and you get cash back and blah, blah, blah. You get a refill bonus because I sent you there. I get a bonus because because you went there. Um, so it's win-win. It's not a credit card or anything like that. It's just a savings thing. I use it for everything that I could think of because then at the end of the like quarter, you get a few dollars back. I think today, Today or this month, I got $3 back. But you know what? I'll take it. It's a Metro card. So, um, and sometimes you get back more. Like Nike will give you back 15% sometimes, which could be a lot of dollars if you're buying sneakers. So, I will see you all soon. Um, Instagram, bad enabler, one word. And that's it. Thank you for everything. I will see you soon. And XO, and XO, and XO, and XO, 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 XO. Oh, and um, Rakuten always has QVC on it. And that's where I get my Josie Marin. So if you want Josie Marin, go to QVC.com. If you want Beekman, go to QVC.com. HSN.com is on there as well. BathandBodyWorks.com and Body Shop, they're all on Rakuten as well. XOXO, bye.